Yeah, that's nice. That bomb shit. What's good guys, it's Rev J again. Well, this week was supposed to be a release video for the Shaq OFP, the official friend of the program, uh, the collaboration that Reebok did with Packer Shoes to re-release the 94... Um, Shaq, the blue, the colorway from Blue Chips. I don't know if you guys ever saw the movie. So that was supposed to be here this week, but however, uh, it takes Packer Shoes a little longer to get a shoe sent over to you than maybe Nike or anybody else. So we're still waiting on those. So hopefully next week those will be the video. In the meantime though, I got hardwood floors here in the apartment and I got a bad back. And so walking around barefoot just, just doesn't work. I usually wear house shoes, slippers, sandals, something like that. Up until now, I had been rocking a pair of the Adisage, the Adidas massaging sandals, but those little things break off and fall out of them, and after, I don't know, six months, eight months, they are worn out. Now, that's not a big deal for a cheap pair of sandals, but at the same time, I don't want to have to replace them every summer, basically, if I don't want to. So, saw something uh, for a good deal up on Zappos and decided you can't go wrong with, uh, with Polo, so we picked up... The uh, Romsey, which is their version of one of the slip-on sandals from Polo Ralph Lauren. Uh, obviously inside the box you got the pony paper, which I love this stuff. Um, the sandal itself, pretty straightforward slip-on sandal, so we're going to keep this one short. Every company makes some form of a slip-on. Adidas obviously has the Adisage and all their different Saj versions of things. Uh, Nike has their slip-on, then Jordan has its version of the exact same Nike slip-on. I don't really like a lot of those. I don't like anything that doesn't have an adjustable band. So I picked up these. Like I said, it's called the Romsey. Um, it's a polo product, obviously. The footbed is this sort of uh, tire tread looking uh, inside. And it looks just like the same uh, sort of plastic that the rest of the shoe is made out of. But it's actually not. It is a bit softer. I don't know if they just use a different foam inside or what. But they're actually pretty darn comfortable. Um, pretty thick raise in the heel here so you get a lot of cushion. They're pretty damn comfortable around the house. So they've got the uh, the polo pony on the top. It's an open top strap, which I told you guys I love because I got nice wide feet. You can see more of the footbed there. Um, they do do them in a few colorways. Uh, this is the black and gray, which was the only one I could find. They do do a black and white that I liked and a red and black that I was a little less hot about, uh, but still pretty cool, so there's some options. Uh, the bottom has, again, sort of a tire print uh, divided tread there. It doesn't make a whole lot of noise, seems to grip pretty good. I tried them on earlier and they were extremely comfortable. Pretty much every bit as comfortable as those adisages that I had, minus the stupid little nubby pieces kind of falling around. Really guys, it's all to them. It's a pretty inexpensive sandal, I mean 35 bucks, yeah it's not cheap like a set of flip flops, uh, but compared to some of the active wear sandals, the Nike sandals which are over 40, this really isn't bad. I like polo anything so I can't complain, um, and really guys, if you need a simple house shoe, something comfortable to slide on for the summer with it coming up, this is the way to go. This upper is uh, is padded. The material won't really hold water or anything like that, so if you get them wet, no big deal. I will show you guys a quick view on foot. So there you go, guys. You've seen them on foot. You saw my basic overview of the Romsey from Polo or Polo Ralph Lauren, whichever way you want to call it. Um, that's all that it is, guys. Pretty straightforward instead of sandals. I got more shoe stuff coming up. I have those Shaq OFPs that I was talking about, hopefully next week or the week after. It might be thawing outside, so there is more car stuff on the way. A lot more coming up this summer, guys. Stay tuned on RevJ. Uh, thank you guys for watching my channel, and as always, we'll see you next time on RevJ.